As we head into the colder months of winter, we have some tips to save you money and help the city meet its climate action goals. You can reduce energy costs by weatherizing your home for winter. Check windows and doors for drafts, then add weather stripping, caulk, or a draft guard to fix air leaks. Routinely replace your furnace filter to help warm air move easily through your house. Install window film or storm windows to help keep warm air indoors. With longer winter nights, switching out old bulbs with energy efficient LEDs can save energy and costs. Change the direction of ceiling fans to rotate clockwise in colder weather to help push warm air back down. Find times when you're out of the house or asleep to set your thermostat to a lower temperature. These small steps can go a long way. These are simple projects using inexpensive materials that you can do whether you rent your home or own your home. And they help reduce heat loss, which is great because you paid for that heat, so you should be able to keep it. But these little steps also add up to cost savings that help us keep costs low as Iowa transitions to cleaner energy sources like solar and wind. Our partners at Green Iowa AmeriCorps are offering free energy saver kits. These include LED light bulbs, high efficiency faucet aerators and shower heads, pipe insulation, and much more. Visit GreenIowaAmeriCorps.org to sign up for your kit. And if you'd like to learn more ways you can help us meet our community-wide carbon reduction goals, visit icgov.org slash climate action. There you can find details on the plan and a toolkit with specific steps you can take at home and work. An Iowa City Park is about to get a big boost from an Iowa Department of Natural Resources grant. The $90,000 REAP grant will be used for ecological restoration and enhancement of the 17 acres of Whispering Meadows Wetland Park. This will help improve the recreational green space of this park on the southeast side of town. We celebrate our local businesses every day, but this week is Small Business Saturday. November 28th is a national holiday to show support for small local businesses. With the pandemic, that may look a little different. But whether you're shopping online or doing curbside pickup, it's never been more important to show up for our Iowa City businesses. And as an added bonus, the city is offering free parking in all the downtown ramps on Saturday. Just make sure to wear a mask and social distance if you're shopping in person. With the Thanksgiving holiday this week, administrative offices at City Hall will be closed on Thursday and Friday. You can see the full list of city services that will be impacted by visiting icgov.org slash Thanksgiving 2020. There will be no curbside collection of refuse, recycling, and organics on Thursday. Those with regular collection on Thursday should set it out on Friday as crews will pick up both routes that day. There will be no transit service on Thursday. Rides are free on Friday and Saturday, but buses will run on a Saturday schedule both days. That's all for this episode. Have a happy and safe Thanksgiving. We'll see you next time on Iowa City Update.